In beekeeping, sugar syrup is measured by weight, regardless of the ratio used. Beekeepers can use different ratios of sugar syrup to encourage different behaviors in the hive. For instance, one to one ratio in the spring and summer encourage comb building, and two to one ratio in the fall to increase food stores for winter. Material list for making sugar syrup. You're going to need a good reliable set of scales. You're going to need obviously your sugar, a mixing dish or a bucket, a measuring cup, and that would probably be the one cup measuring cup, um, a mixing spoon or something to mix the sugar water with, and your hot water. One gallon one to one syrup recipe. Is five pounds of sugar dissolved into two and a half quarts of water or 5.14 pounds of water. One gallon of two to one syrup recipe is eight pounds of sugar dissolved into four pounds of hot water or eight cups of water. Each gallon of syrup adds seven pounds of food stores to a beehive. 2 to 1 sugar water. That's 20 pounds of sugar and 10 pounds of water. And you want to make sure you get it mixed up really well. Be the time that you'd wanted to go ahead and add any essential oils that you like using. Um, I believe wintergreen is a good essential oil to use going into winter. It helps fight uh, Nozema. I like to use this Nozabet Plus. It's certified organic, so I'm going to put a few drops of this in here and get it stirred in. What is Nozema? Nozema is a gut disease that weakens the bees during the winter and into spring. It keeps the bees from building up very fast come spring, so it's a good idea to treat for this. Some other sugar syrup additives are essential oils and these are not fragrance oils it's used for candles um, they would be thyme oil spearmint oil peppermint oil lemongrass oil etc there's a lot of them out there so do some research on it and each one of these have a different effect on the colony there's also nose of it plus and this helps fight nosema um, a lot of people like to use honey be healthy and this is a mixture of essential oils uh, that's been shown to help boost the colony's strength.